feel like you're taking care of yourself, your body, your mind, it all generates good health and great vibes. Hey, what's up? It's Jordan Clarkson, taking you through a day of my workouts. For me, I got drafted by the Los Angeles Lakers. Played there for uh, three, four years. Traded to the Cleveland Cavaliers, where we went to the finals 2018-2019 season. Then got traded to Utah Jazz, where I ended up winning sixth man of the year. You know, being a sixth man, first player off the bench, always got to be ready. Being able to impact the game as quick as I can. So fitness and working out has always been a big part of my journey. I started playing basketball like seventh, eighth grade. Before that, I was super active, just kind of doing everything, track and field, skating, volleyball, basketball, everything. And then after eighth, ninth grade, I kind of just funneled everything out and just uh, continued to keep playing basketball. My fitness routine has changed. I don't lift as much. A lot of it is full body movement, stretching, different functional stuff that keeps me active and you know keeps everything intact. A day of training for me, court workout in the morning, uh, on the court session, go from 45 minutes to an hour and 30. Variety of shooting drills, ball handling, sometimes some conditioning uh, in between the drills, getting me running and moving. If I'm making shots, it's a good flow to the workout. But, you know, everything has its mistakes and stuff that you gotta, you know, deal with. Uh, a lot of it is all active and, you know, getting me right for the game. After the court, usually head to the weight room. Workout in the weight room consists of goblet squats, lunges, a RDL to a press, shoulder ITYs, getting my mobility for my shoulders right. Majority of the time, I don't wear shoes in the weight room. I'm in socks or barefoot, or just so I can you know, feel the ground. Very good for stability. Viper is something that I used when I was in college, actually. It's really a warm-up thing for me. I just kind of get everything in my body flowing. A lot of it is flexibility and you know, strength in that. It is all movement. It's, uh, it's your back, your abs, your lats, everything is in use at that point. The rotation is the toughest part about that exercise. It's a bunch of stability and balance. Goblet lateral lunge is something that we use to warm up for every practice, every game. Whoa, we do do that like every day. That's crazy. Helps with balance, uh, stability, firing our core. Sometimes it's with bands. Variation of that exercise goes forever. Our RDL curl press for me, it's working my hip mobility, also my biceps and my shoulders. Working my back as well. Full body exercise for me. Something that gets me ready for everything in the game. Shoulder ITYs are something for strength. The weight can vary as well, but I like to keep the weight down just to strengthen the mobility and the movement in my shoulders. Cause you know, we use those a lot. Lifting, pushing off and, you know, raising up to shoot a jump shot. All that comes through our shoulders. Strengthening in that will help a lot of things during the games as well. Really flexibility, stability, and balance. That's the three things that all these exercises and moves that I do in the weight room help me the most. After the gym, game, lifts, anything that goes on throughout my day, take my time and meditate and breathe. The mental health thing is something that I've been concentrating on like the last three, four years. A big part of that was Kevin Love, one of my teammates in Cleveland. He's a big advocate in mental health. Now I, I really take the time out of my day to you know, really focus on that part so I can be the best version of me. Even if it's five minutes, 10 minutes, it takes you to a, a really good place in a peaceful state. I think it's a, a big part of you know, just being happy. And it's a wrap. Thank you for training with me today here at Lifetime Gym. It's been an amazing day. Peace out, y'all.